Hello everyone, how are you doing? My name is Itsunu. Okay, um, this is a new channel that I I made up my mind that hey, I'm going to you know begin another channel because I don't want to mix up you know um, titles, I mean programs so that youtube will not be confused that okay what's what exactly is this one doing i call this channel no holds bar no holds but that means we are not holding anything back we're no holds bar we're going to be saying things the way they are um this channel was inf informed by you know events around us in nigeria in all over the world that once in a while i i hope every week that i will be coming on to discuss with you on this channel and i hope that the the idea is to is to liberate is to liberate people because I say it all the time people 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 a lot of time put their brain to sleep so maybe we can you know use this medium and other you know platforms out there to to liberate them to say hey <laughs> wake up so no host bar that's that's what this channel is going to be um actually w something happened last week that i uh, that informed this like i said but i don't want to start the channel on a on a negative note on this on on a on a on a sad note that's why i'm going to be beginning today i'm going to be opening this channel today with good news and i i pray that we will be hearing good news all the time can i hear amen amen so the good you've heard about it but i'm going to look at you know situations around some of these things so the good news that i'm going to be looking at today is the is the recent announcement of the rccg that they will be committing some money into charity so that's 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 what i'm actually going to be talking about today because we discovered that when good things happen bloggers out there they don't talk about it they just you know pretend as if they didn't know but it is if it were in the negative the internet will be broken everywhere will be agog you know by negative story anyway i'm a journalist by profession and one of the definitions of news is when unusual thing happen that's news and back in school they gave us this um you know have i said happy sunday no today's not okay this one accommodated. I have another channel accommodated. The proof for it. Okay, all right. So, <laughs> one of the definitions of news, as I was taught in school, is when when something uh, unusual happen, when something that is not expected happen, that is news. In in example, we were, were given back then. They will say when a dog bites a man that is news that's no news but when a man bites a dog that becomes news so that's why when unusual thing happen it becomes um, news so what i want us to look at today is the recent announcement by the redeemed Christian Church of God of his intention to spend some huge amount of money you know they they, they want to commit um, 18.4 billion naira which is 36 
million dollars u.s dollars you know what what the u.s dollars is saying now those of you who are spending it okay you are spending it okay i know you are spending it so now rcc said they want to commit 18.4 um, billion naira into charity and um hey it's huge so that's why it's okay let me start this channel with this good news and um you already had it and in case if you are not had it i'm telling you now am i rcc gpro no am i pastor the bios uh the boys pro no am i his image maker no but when uh when things of this happen i want us bloggers to to be in the habit of blowing the trumpet if it were negative like i said if they have said god forbid my pastor has impregnated somebody hey by now the the um, the internet will have been broken that's how we say it when 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 news is you everybody everybody that is somebody everybody that is not not that somebody will have blocked some people will have even opened up a ch new channel because of that now this charity it's it's even uh even in human relationship that's what we see all the time when someone does good when someone has uh, has done you uh, has done people good people don't uh, really talk about it they don't they don't they don't announce it but hey let the person do you bad everybody will hear about it this is this is a culture of the human race that shouldn't be let us talk about the positives of people you know in your personal relationship in your interpersonal relationship with your day-to-day -day with people once they have done good to you and when people do good to you and one day something happened and you perceive that that person did wrong don't forget the past remember that some some that was a time this person was like this that's why we have a lot of broken homes out there am i relationship uh, uh, what do they call them <laughs> mental no <laughs> but if you remember the good that your spouse or your friend has done you will you will excuse you know they are wrong so what are we saying this money this this foundation is called is love foundation is love foundation he is there referring to god it's love foundation and they are going to uh, be setting up uh, food centers, free food centers, and um, they call them uh, yeah food centers in Lagos. That's that's what we call food banks in the U.S. So they are going to be doing that. They are going to be um, there's going to be a donation of uh, kidney dialysis machine can you imagine the number of people that are dying because of dialysis and who can't afford to do dialysis god forbid i and you will not see surge but there are people out there who are suffering from kidney diseases and they need dialysis so this foundation his love foundation is going to be donating uh, a machine to the uh, Ola BC on a bunch of uh, teaching hospital in Shagamu mm? yeah. in Ogun State. You know where Shagamu is if you're in Nigeria. Uh -huh. So, so and and a whole bunch, bunch, bunch of things. So, um, I want us to, I want us, like I said, bloggers out there, um, broadcast good news all right you are you are at liberty to to broadcast whatever you want to broadcast but when things of this nature happens 
let us blow the trumpet let us announce let us announce let us let us say it so like i said as from next week i'm going to be i'm going to be for now even i'm going to be treating some things you have heard ab about but in my own special way my own uh, i'm going to put my own touch as a journalist to it because if i'm going to write write on this this kind of thing i want to discuss i know how i would do backgrounding i mean you know there was the, i had an editor in the guardian who <laughs> Hey, I said, are you able to pee? Are you able to Because back in the Guardian, I I report ROCCG events. If 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 that I able to come to Abuja, I report it. If I go to the, the camp for program, I report his his um his, his message and all that. In in actual fact. Uh, as Adeboye has a column in the Guardian where his sermon is being is being uh, published, so all right. So when it is good, let's announce it. Though not only when it is bad. So we are, you know, congratulating the Redeemed Christian Church of God and for your information, the 69th annual convention starts today. In Lagos, all right. Um, this is not a paid announcement, but <laughs> if you have the where we there, just you know, go to the camp. I miss the camp. I mean, I, I miss the camp. You know, I just miss the camp. So go there. I mean, and you meet God there, live and direct. This is not a paid announcement. Honestly, that is just me. So we, I want to thank you for watching today's program. Um, look out for those centers in Lagos, the food centers. I'm sure uh, later we're going to be doing, we're going to be, you know, bringing to you uh, where they are, their locations. Trust me, now, I'm going to be doing a lot of follow up on a lot of these things. So until I come your way again next week, my name is Itsuno. Have a blessed day and uh, be safe out there. Hey, coronavirus is real. Please keep yourself safe and God bless you. Bye.